Hi everybody, I'm Mike McCrory and this is Would You Make It? I made a cell phone and tablet stand for friends of mine several months ago, right before Christmas, and they wanted it because they do regular video calls between the US and France where Grandma and Grandpa live. And so now Grandma and Grandpa want to have one on the other end. So I made version two. Uh, this, is this, this is the new version. I've already made it and I'm not going to go through the build in this video because I've pretty much done that already. Um, there are just a few changes and I thought it would be worthwhile for me to point out. Um, it might give you some ideas on how you might go about building one. So here we go. <music> This time I cut a recess for the Lazy Susan bearing instead of screwing it directly into the base. And this made for a closer tolerance and a nicer fit. The other thing I did is I made the tray in two separate pieces so that it could be extendable to hold the tablet or cell phone either in landscape or portrait mode. And I put a, a hook on the top as well to keep it from falling out, just in case it was tilted vertically. And so now it's really easy to just pull the top up and flip the tablet into the portrait position and then slide the top back down. And it just holds itself in place with gravity. You don't have to screw it in place. The third change I made when cutting the slot into the top of the column that goes up and down is that I made the side walls thinner. And that way, when you're tightening, uh, the wood flexes a little bit more and it's easier to tighten and it doesn't require using a wrench or a pair of pliers. So the slider on the tray has a, a pretty simple design, the way the mechanism works, and we'll take a closer look at it. It's really just got a, a slot cut in the middle and two pieces of wood glued and one on each side. And then this is the other piece cut in the opposite way. It's got a piece coming up the middle and there's a groove on each side and that's where those other strips of wood fit into. And this is made up of three pieces of wood, uh, one piece on each side and then the piece in the middle is what clamps into the column. And then there's another piece glued on the bottom and that way it can hold the tablet and then the same on the top. It's relatively simple, but it's very effective in keeping everything in place and being adjustable. So I gotta ask, would you make it? <laughs> 